This is Martin Carlyle with Learn GDB from Pico CTF 2018. Using a debugging tool will be extremely useful. Can you run this program in GDB and find the flag? You can find the file here. It gives me a folder. So I'm going to go ahead and look around that folder. There's a program called run. I'll run that. It tells me it's decrypting the flag into a global variable called flag buff. I'm going to wait a little bit here. Oh, and it finished reading the flag, but it just exited without telling what the flag is. So I'm going to now run it in GDB. I'm going to set a breakpoint in main. So every C program has a subroutine called main, which is where it starts. And if I use a GDB tutorial, that'll give me a lot of useful commands for GDB, like break. Another one here is going to be X for examine memory. So I'm going to get 32 instructions. And on a 64-bit machine, RIP is the instruction pointer. So I'm going to get 32 instructions starting at the beginning of main. And you'll see here that it calls the set vbuff, it calls put s, it calls decrypt flag, it calls put s again. So I'll just set a breakpoint on put s. I'll continue. There's the first one where it says decrypting the flag into a global variable. So I'll hit C for continue again. That's decrypting the flag. I'll just wait. We get to the end. And now it says there's a global variable called flag buff. So I'll use X again to examine memory. This slash S means a string at the location flag buff. And here's my flag. So I'll just copy that. And there you go.